Hello, welcome to LEV Toys. Okay, so I have here the ravaged carcass of Livy's pop star house. <laughs> Is that dramatic? Does that even work for a Lego, <laughs> Lego set? Well, it has, it's been pillaged over the years. I've stolen pieces out of it so that I can use them in my own custom builds. And now I'm feeling remorse because it's just not the magnificent build that it used to be. And I want my pop star house back in its all its splendid goodness. For reasons. Reasons which I will maybe reveal at the end of this video. Look, the glass is all gone. Glass is queen here in my custom builds and that's first, always the first thing for me to steal. In fact, I'm surprised these big glass panels at the front haven't been stolen. <laughs> so today I decided I'm, I was going to rebuild this anyway, but I thought, why do it alone? I can build it with you guys. <laughs> maybe you'll enjoy watching it get built again for reasons. There are reasons. So. Rather than buying a brand new set, which at the moment around about $250 on Bricklink, I discovered that I have pretty much all of the pieces here in my collection. There aren't any unique parts in this. These black cabinets are actually quite rare though. I think they only come in two sets and the pop star set being one of them. So I did order some more of them off Bricklink, but the rest of the stuff in here is reasonably commonplace in Lego Friends builds. So I just discovered I have duplicates of just about everything. I did order a sticker sheet from off Bricklink for a couple of dollars. So with a sticker sheet and parts from my existing collection, Collection, I can build another pop star house without taking the pilfered parts out of my custom builds Which I don't want to break down. So here we go in this box. I have everything I need However, I don't have the paper instructions. I do they're put away somewhere and I don't want to go hunting for them I actually really like using digital instructions So I go to lego.com and on here you have all the building instructions for all of the sets and you don't even need to remember the sets number if you just have a search like for here, Livy's pop star house. It's not coming up at all, but if I show all the results, it'll be down here somewhere. So here we go, here it is. So you click on view instructions. There we go. And now you can see that there are three different booklets that came with this and you download them. So click on download PDF and they, this, I've done this on my computer screen, but I normally do it on my iPad and then I export this into books so that I can just flick through the page, like through iBooks. And I just love doing it like this because that way it's backlit and I can really see the instructions clearly because the paper instructions, I don't know if this happens to you or if it's just me and my rubbish eyes, but the glare off the light often makes it really annoying using the paper instructions. So I've got all tech now. I love using the digital instructions. So I am all ready. I have everything I need, including the characters. So Livy, oh my gosh, can we not reintroduce Libby back into the Lego Friends world. She's such a fun character and her clothes were the bomb. They really, really are the best clothes. Her hairpiece also, we'll talk about that in a moment. Let's put her skirt on. I do get very excited about her hairpiece. So she has these fabric skirts. There are actually three of them included in this set. And I don't really love the fabric skirts, so I haven't used this very much. So it's still looking really good for a four year old fabric skirt. <laughs> uh, they do start to fray a bit, but this one's still looking really nice. Her hairpiece, I really love this hairpiece. It's Ariel's hairpiece, which is in red, but she introduced it in pink and blue and Susan has it in yellow as well. So I do love that. Andrea was also included in this set, whether they were living together or whether they were just hanging out together. I don't know, but I like to think that they were actually roommates at some stage. So. She gets a skirt as well. And once again, I love this top. I just loved the pop star tops and I still love them. Okay, so Andrea's ready. She also has got, oh, sorry. Did I fail to forget? This is like retro Andrea. This is Andrea before the before the reboot. So <laughs> if, if she looks a bit different, you've only just joined Lego friends, that's why. So this is retro Andrea. That's what I'm calling her. And they have the ubiquitous sunglasses, pink for Andrea, purple for Livy. And they're ready, so let's bash into the putting this build back together again. <laughs> bash into getting the build. We will not bash the build. I really love the fact that I now have got these stickers in duplicates because I use them in lots of different builds. They're just really, really versatile. So much more so than a lot of the Lego friends printed pieces or stickered pieces. Look at these skirts, they're ridiculous. You can't sit in them. Oh, I forgot about Cookie. So Cookie was the dog. The Dalmatian with strange looking music spots on it, a bit grubby, uh, but you know, nothing that a bit of soap couldn't clean up. So Cookie came with this set and Cookie was Livy's puppy and here's Cookie's little, what do you call that thing? You know, bed, dog bed, dog bed and a bone. And this is supposed to go over here, but we're not going to actually add to our old build. We're going to make a completely 
pretty new one with the pieces that I have. So, following the instructions, let's go. Let's put the, <laughs> I was about to say whack this together. Bang it together, whack it together. I'm feeling very, very violent today. Mm, concerning and crazy. All right, so this grassed area here has one of my favorite pool pieces. I mean, it's all very square. This whole house and the pool and everything is very, very straight edged. And you know what? I really, really like it. So the pool's got a little waterfally thing going into it. It's got some translucent pieces at the back, lots of different pinks and blues going on. Blue going around the pool edge, and then it all gets lined with magenta. Pink, 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 blue, blue, blue. And on the side, I stole these decking boards so many years ago from the original build. I think they actually went into, um, they went into the Darlington's outside, where they had the big deck next to their pool, their above ground pool. So that's where those decking boards have been for quite some time. Some flowers along the front, which I think would probably look different now because we've got so many different bits of foliage. And the umbrella, I was just this silly orange disc. So I'm actually going to change this to a pink umbrella because I like this more. <laughs> I do have the orange one, but seriously, this one's like nicer and it will provide more coverage. So that's important. Okay, pool area looks pretty much like it is done. Now we get to start on the house. We start on a tan base plate, which once again, pieces that I thankfully have 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 heaps of and I was this the very first build where we used sliding doors glass sliding doors I can't remember but we're decking out the inside first so we're fitting out the inside I don't know what you deck so I liked I liked Livy's house because it was full of healthy options she she had smoothies ice cream at the top but fruit and veg to make her smoothies out of and one of the few sets that had sushi and we don't have sushi in any of the recent sets. I really think we need sushi to come back. I need more sushi in my life. We got three different forms of waffles. Could we please have more sushis? And this is the lamp that goes in the living room and I've used this. I think I stole this lamp to put in Rapunzel's, no, yes. Yes, in Rapunzel's modern day apartment, it makes such a spectacular floor lamp. Now, these big glass panels, I actually don't have any more of these, so I'm gonna steal them from the old set and pop them in here. And they're still looking nice and new and not scratched up at all because they haven't been mixed in with my other Lego rumbling around getting scratched. That is the problem with translucent and transparent pieces. So sliding doors, this was such a revelation to me. It looks so modern and cool. And I love, love, loved and still love all of the glass, I just love so much glass. The smoky, smoky glass uh, around here in this fireplace, why is it not fitting? That should fit, like that little pin should go through there. All the holes are in that right place. What's happening? That does not fit. That's weird, let me grab another little brown flower and poke it, that, that fits in that one. Is this maybe some, no, it's definitely Lego. Okay, I don't know, I'll investigate that later. Uh, let's continue building our fireplace. So this goes in the middle. Oh my gosh, I just, I had forgotten how much I loved this set. No, I didn't, I've always loved this set. <laughs> it still stands up uh, after, you know, it stands up to the test of time, it's just gorgeous. So we have black stairs going up at the back of the pool, heading up to the second level, and they are interspersed with a whole heap of translucent pieces and color. It's just so rock star, I love it. There's little yellow lights, and this hinge on the top helps hold all this together, and our stairs are going up, and we are so close to the second level, but there's lots and lots of stuff that still needs to go down in the bottom level. And in here, we've got Livy's gold, you know, her award, though this is in like just about every Lego friend set, so everybody's got one, it's quite commonplace. Out the front, out the front she gets, um, I'm trying to, what do we get out the front? Out the front, she probably needs a bit more of a security system or I, I, I feel like these days she needs a whole gated community because the little electronic thing with all of the glass at the front is not going to keep her very, uh, very protected from stands. So yeah, I think she needs to have a big electric gate house thing at the front of the house. Anyway, on the inside we have this corner couch, corner sofa, which I once again have replicated many, many times for my own custom builds, stolen the cushion pieces off this 
for so many pieces. Just love it. Love it so much. I think it's because I just love this sort of idea for my own house. So corner piece, corner lounge goes inside in the here in the corner logically right next to the gorgeous modern glass fireplace and a little newspaper rack over here and in the middle a kitchen island with some stools <laughs> strangely enough these stools are still sitting immaculately in my original build now these actually go in between the studs I have seen this listed as an illegal connection you know something that is not proper Lego connection before but Seriously, Lego's been doing it in their official sets for quite some time, as this proves. She's got her television up there so she can watch while she's busy cooking. Surely she needs someone to cook for her, but cooking is a really good de-stressor as well. This is her kitchen island set up with, no it's not, this is her sink with the dishwashing detergent. And in here we've got orange utensils. So it was an orange pack which came with this. Now I went searching for the plates and discovered I actually have two different types of orange plates. So it's the one with the skinny rim which came with this particular set. So this goes over here in the corner right near the front door. There's a croissant on the plate which I think is really good pop star fare. Got a mixer up here and some strawberry jam to go on the croissant. Now back to the kitchen island bench. The drawers in this are filled with cutlery so we've got three knives in the top and three forks in the bottom and we've had spoons released since this set was made but spoons are only available in silver I wonder whether we're gonna see them in more colors soon that would be really fun <laughs> we can have matching cutlery oh and this newspaper is this the only I was just thinking is this the only Lego friends newspaper that's ever been released and seriously if it is it's time for an update I can't think of another one there could be but I don't think there is. Okay, and on this plate is the sushi that I was talking about before. Want to see more sushi? Lego, more sushi please. That would be really, really great. All right, it looks like we are packed out down the bottom. So we are heading on to the next level and the next level doesn't have just one big solid tan base plate. So the little plates all need to be connected and Oh, look at that. So we're using purple studs to fill up the spaces. Does that mean that at this stage we didn't actually have purple little square plates like that? You know, little square ones to fit there? I wonder. I could go and look, but <laughs> I don't care that much. <laughs> okay, over on the side, we've got some more cupboardy kind of things happening. I'm pretty sure this was her wardrobe. Yes, it was. It was a wardrobe that I stole the glass out of in the original one, which meant all the contents of the wardrobe fell out and subsequently got lost. So here we go. We're going to do it all again. Make it all beautiful again. Make it all complete. I'm a completionist. <laughs> I have discovered that actually. I've become more of a completionist as I've got older. It's concerning. Oh, her bed. Oh my gosh. Once again, still one of my most favorite Lego bed designs. I just love it. It's flat, it's modern. I love the upholstery on it and I've used this far too much too, I think. I just love it. Okay, hanging up in her cupboard, she's got one of those skirts. She's got her guitar up on the wall. And here is the replaced glass cupboard door. Yay! Actually, a glass cupboard door is not the best idea because you can see all the mess inside. I need an opaque cupboard door so I can shut it and no one can see it. Oh, also, fun fact time! Did that come out correctly? Fun fact, fun fact time! The orange roller skates that are in her cupboard were only released in 2015 and 2016. We have not seen that colour ever again and they were only in actually no that's a lie I was about to say they're only in the pop star sets but that's not true they were in other little sets too but we have not seen them again other colors yes no orange ones Ooh, so orange ones are reasonably not that common is that words was that words I think it was orange ones are not that common probably is a better phrase okay this is her dressing table nothing new really and interesting on there and we get the stickers on the front and the back for her shower in the back. I do, I, I do have to say that I think that these stickers are a bit dated. The actual stickers that are going in the new Lego Friends sets look so much better than these older ones. But the rest of the design still holds up, I think. This is her camera, her television to look at um, on her bed and the camera, security camera that's overlooking the pool, which we'll be installing soon. Still like the little modern silver saucepan. It just, it all still, still stands up beautifully. Oh, and this flesh colored stud for soap, really light flesh colors. I really like that. And it's 
not something that's very common. I love that little soap piece. That little soap. <laughs> Imagine just loving a little stud. I loved a little light flesh stud. Okay, out on the balcony we have all these glass pieces which were long gone on my original set. I stole them. I stole them good. I stole them early. Especially the single ones, the single brick ones because they are reasonably hard for me to come by. And I need another glass panel for up here. <laughs> there we go. St still stealing from the original set. <laughs> but we will have one completed set by the time this is finished and that makes me happy. So that's where the that little ball joint there is where the camera is going to go. We've got small lights going on the front and the tan pieces smoothing over the top. I, st I also think that Lego really hit the nail on the head with the colour scheme for this particular set. They're complementary, they go really well together and they just look so lush and luxe and perfect for a pop star. I love it. I love it. I really do. Okay, <laughs> pretty sure I've mentioned that before too. Some smooth clean white for the top of the balcony and a tropical palm and I think that's pretty much done. So this now installs up here. Got our gorgeous modern apartment. Is it postmodernist? I actually don't know what the definition of postmodern architecture is but it's definitely it's very modern and on the top we need the little roofy bit little curved roofy bit with this random thing that's in the middle of it I still have no idea what that is for apart from to hold the two plates underneath more sturdily together but uh, it's a splash of color up here and all of this white and this little black bit underneath is actually to line it up with the the room below we've got a plant up here and if I can just get in the right spot it's done so here we go, we've got, why does that staircase go above the actual step of the top level there? Does that make any sense? You can see what I'm talking about. And the plate down here, another plate is down here for Cookie's bone. And then we are completely completed. This is what it looked like. So here we go, comparison. Here's my old ruined shell of the original pop star house built all the way back on this channel in 2016, just for you and me. <laughs> for everybody and now it has been rebuilt re not remodeled or refurbished because I haven't added anything new to it apart from the umbrella but it is redone but I mentioned reasons in capital letters back at the beginning of this video for me wanting to rebuild this set and here are a few little hints about what I have planned for the next video Ooh, secrets! Actually, it won't be a secret for very long, so you need to guess. Let me know in the comments. And now would be a really good time to subscribe if you haven't already clicked the little notification bell so you get, you get notified when the new one comes up. And then you will find out! You will find out! It'll be very, very exciting. So, check back in. It will be happening soon. Now I need to go back and I need to continue planning. <laughs> so, a lot of work to do. I'll see you soon. Bye!